Welcome to the Booty Dance More Than Fitness podcast. And today we're going to be bringing in two special guests. So if you guys remember Renee and Coach Daisy, they're going to be joining us today as we're going to be talking about how to reach new heights in our fitness. Let's get started. Booty Bands and Barbells helps busy women sculpt and tone their bodies in just 15 minutes a day through our physical products and our one-on-one coaching. All right. So you guys, um, if you remember Renee, um, Renee, how long have you been in the program for Renee? Do you know how many months? Um, I started at the end of May. Awesome. So uh, go ahead and tell us how your journey's been going. So um, I started out like gangbusters, but I was kind of like, I don't know if I can do this. Is this like everything else? But I really like enjoyed um, the workouts and trying to um, navigate the plan. But then I really relied a lot on what I saw online and people's testimonies and, you know, the live um, podcasts and stuff like that. Um, And I, I liked it a lot and I still like it a lot, but I like it. Like, I really like it now. Like I feel in a completely different place and what we in, um, we're going to start July. So we're at the end of June, but in that process of having, I had an injury. So then I got, um, down and out and depressed and felt bad with myself. Um, and a couple of times I hit those points with you where, um, I was sad and depressed and I fell back into that old story of my life. Um, you know, that worthlessness and stuff, but I've made a conscious effort since the last time we talked about, um, actually it was like an emergency phone call from you, which I greatly appreciated to really focus on myself and the positives and put the negatives behind me. And so I stuck those post-it notes all over the place and I really watched online and read people's Facebook stories on the Facebook, um, feed and, um, really delve into the, all the different areas that you talked about. And I've really, it's been amazing to me. Cause like I say that today was like a, a, a flip of a switch for me. I've been, I'm in a different mind space and I'm thankful for that because I've been almost like, you're almost like waiting for it and don't know when it's going to happen. So for me, like now over the course of these last couple of weeks and shifting that and looking at my truths and sticking to the plan and focusing on my protein and getting the best, um, you know, exercise I can in of the the different routines minus not being able to use that leg or that lower portion of my body with my, you know, my booty and stuff. I still have, I now have that positive attitude and I, I really am super thankful for everybody because I think you don't truly realize, even though you're not, you're not physically with these people all the time, how much their stories and their routines and maybe their prepping of their food or a recipe, how much it really gets you through the day and to look forward to it at night when you sit and read it or whenever you do it. But it's been a journey. I think mentally I'm stronger. And right now I'm more grateful for that because that part can destroy you. And I feel like you, um, Danny have tremendously helped me. And so have the other women in this program. And I don't think people realize on the other side of it, um, how much you can truly help each other and not even know you are. Oh, I've cold chills. (laughs) (laughs) just appreciate your words. I appreciate your honesty. I appreciate your vulnerability showing up on those. You leaned on me. And that's what I asked you to do is lean on me in those tough times. And you did every single time. And, uh, to see, a a hundred percent of a flip on, uh, just your attitude and your gratitude and your positivity and how you said you were, you're doing things that you wouldn't have done before. I love that. You said you're running around with your daughter and doing that shopping in a wheelchair, which is really cool to hear you're starting to kind of break free of that limitations of yourself previous and really stepping into the person you're meant to be. And I, yeah, I feel like that. And I, you know what I really noticed, like I used to have this um, problem with, you know, like I was like, you live with people, but you feel lonesome, but I am really finding um, peace and like comfort and tranquility in those alone times where I'm, learning about myself or meditating about just meditating or putting on 
some music and just relaxing or saying, you know what, I did that upper body workout, but I'm going to do it again tonight. And I'm by myself and I'm a, a room by myself. And it's so not so disconnected to learn to be okay with just being yourself and okay. Like no matter what your situation is. So that in itself is another huge piece for me. And I, I honestly, like today was really the day that, and it's funny that it was a day that I was scheduled to talk with you because I, I, I felt this lightness about me. I felt this, um, peace, like a peace, like an inner peace with myself, you know, and I haven't had that kind of peace. I haven't had that kind of peace in like over 20 years, more than 20 years. It's got to be over 25 years. So that that's huge for me. That's huge for me. When you take all that mental out of it, you know, all that mental beating up and all that mental, it's almost like mental bullying. You're playing with your own mind, you know, um, and you think in the positive way and positive things start coming to you or you even, you know, maybe you're not having the best day, but you're like, you can always find that piece of gratefulness and blessing in it. And then it's almost like everything else comes a little bit easier, not easy, but a little bit easier. Like your workout isn't hard or you're not dreading doing something or you don't have to be like, oh, I have to meal prep. It doesn't even feel like that. It feels like, like I said today, coming home from work, oh my God, I can't wait to have my protein shake. And I said that it tasted like it was a million dollar protein shake today. Like you enjoy, I enjoyed it. And then I did my exercises and I added a little bit extra and I, I did too, actually. Um, so I don't know. It's just a different, there's something it's different. It's different. Mm -hmm. I like, I guess I had, you know, that aha moment. Yeah. What a cool aha moment. So my question I have for you is why is, why is mindset so important to create the ripple effect of nutrition and workouts? And why is it that that's so needed instead of just giving you a meal plan and just giving you a bunch of workouts? Why do you think you have to have that third piece of the mindset? Because honestly, it's when your mindset isn't in the right place and you don't have that focus on it, like when I was down in the dumps and dreary and depressed and feeling worthless, you know, you tend to, in my mind, I would tend to, well, I don't care. You tend to go for those things that are going to be a quick, easy fix to satisfy that mind piece at that time. So it might have been you ate something that was like not what you wanted to have, and then you felt guilty, and then so it spiraled out of control. So then when I turned the page and focused on that mindset as far as the truths of myself, I don't find that. I find that with my mindset in a better place, all that other like the nutrition piece and the your mindset is so positive that you tend to go towards the positivity of it. Like, okay, I'm going to prep these meals or I'm going to make this salad like I made today, this big salad and have it for lunch. And then I'll have this leftover. And I, you know, try to lift little different things with it, putting in it and stuff. You feel like in your mind, like that's an accomplishment and you're in a more positive place. So you tend what I've noticed is I've tended to just keep it going, you know, um, I just, it's just so huge. That mindset piece is huge because when your mind is in that right place, it seems to just kind of flow. You know, if you just gave me a plan and said, here, follow this, you know, diet and, um, check back with me in a month, you know, follow this diet and check back with me in a month. And you didn't give me that connection to you that those last couple of times where we've talked when I've literally was sobbing and I don't want to do this anymore. And I felt like I couldn't breathe and the world was coming down around me. I would have been hung out to dry and I wouldn't have probably taken your phone call and I would have probably reached for that comfort food and fell into that guilt and it just would have been worse. But you showed me the way to focus on the positive mindset and reading my truths. And it truly does 
make that pattern for the rest of this program fall right into place. Mindset was huge. And I remember it is huge. And I remember when we started and you kept telling me about this mindset and I kept thinking, well, why do I have to keep going over this in my head with this mindset? Like, but then when it broke it down and basically the doo-doo hit the fan, so to speak, when I was in a low point, I got it. And I followed it and I was like, this is what's happening to me. I have to break the cycle in my mind. And the only way I did it was reading the truths and then following that plan and then listening to the plan and looking at how, you know, really this is what the protein does. And this is, you can't follow it and not have all of that information because I don't, it just wouldn't be right. So to have all of that that you give, those components of what you give really is probably the best. Um, it's probably it's been the best thing for me. And it's so completely different than anything else that I've done. So I'm like truly grateful and appreciative for it. Yeah, girl. Yeah, my girl. It's the truth. It's the truth. It's the truth. That's cool. So if somebody is, uh, I just want to see if somebody, if, if somebody's struggling and they're kind of in that depressive, sad state that you were in, what is something that you would tell them if you could just speak from your heart of kind of like where you, where you were before? I would tell them this. I would tell them this, that first of all, I think I only crossed over from that depressive, sad, lonesome, worthless state because of what you did with me um danny when you took that time to to go through that and see how that cycle goes and then to follow those truths when you get to that stage um and you're involved in this program reach out to danny reach out to another member reach out to somebody that's online with you because there's truly the support and maybe when you start you don't really realize it but there truly is that support from people and follow that tr write it down pick out all the positives about yourself and follow that and look at it every single day and follow those truths because that's exactly what it is. It's the truth. And we go through women, I think more so than anybody go through this cycle of putting everybody else first. And then you go through things in your life that make you hit rock bottom and you put yourself last. But when you really reach out, and like, I reached out to you. I'm like, I don't know what to do because I'm not going to get through this because I'm a disaster and so sad. But that truly to look back at that and to have that availability to keep looking back at that, focus on yourself, focus on your positives, focus on your blessings, you know? So maybe you can't walk, but you have two legs. Um, you can't walk for a while. Maybe you, Maybe you're sad and you feel like, you know, this day is terrible and I'm in a terrible mood, which I'll st I'm still going to have bad days, but, you know, open your curtains or step outside and look at the sun and the birds and the, there's so many beautiful things around. And like my children, like the biggest blessing in the world is my children. And for me to say, oh, I ate a cookie and I'm so mad at myself. I'm guilty. Like, really, is that going to that's not going to be the be all end all of me. I'm still going to get up tomorrow and have these beautiful children and be able to say, you know what? I did bad yesterday, but today I'm going to do better. So those things happen. But let me tell you what, you're here for a reason. And and we have a purpose. I have a purpose. Everybody has a purpose. And Danny, your purpose was to do this for us women. How do you like that? And you're a blessing. So I say to anybody that's struggling, if you're part of this program, reach out to the people that are involved in this program, the, the coaches, the people that are um, online, just reach out to somebody because someone will help you. And you truly will, if you focus on it, it will, it will get you to where you need to be. Uh, let's just celebrate Renee for a second. Renee, put your hands up. Let's just go ahead and do some snaps right now. I just want you to feel that, feel that great, beautiful feeling that you can speak from your heart. You can really send a message out there to the world. And hopefully this video right now can just change. If it's just one person's life, you know, we, not, we both, we all know what that feeling feels like a feeling lost, forgotten, yep. about, 
totally just feeling like there's no hope. And so what a beautiful coming from your truth. Like it just, it was so screaming of just from your, the depths of you, of just that alignment you feel. And, and I just want to thank you for being vulnerable to express that because I truly think that, you know, I can come up here all day and say, how cool can change your life. But truly it comes from somebody that's gone through it to come yeah. to their place, their witness and say a little bit different in their own words. And so I just, I really appreciate you for that. Thank you. So I have really never stuck with anything for more than six months until I found Booty Bands Barbell. It's life-changing. The progress over perfection mindset has been so life-changing. You have self-love and to have self-worth. I just do the 10 minutes and I'm already reaping the benefits. The workouts are fun and that they're effective. I have seen great results that I never thought I'd ever see. I love it because I'm keeping the weight off. We help hold each other accountable as they commit to our goals. Booty Bands and Barbells has really changed my life for the better. I have to be real with you. The past six months really took a toll on me and my body. I felt incredibly stressed, isolated. After being a good 12 to 13 pounds heavier, I said, that's it, I'm gonna make healthy choices. And I'm happy to tell you today that I am actually down 15 pounds. I feel amazing. I feel like I lost fat and put on muscle. I have a lot more energy. So it's never too late to start. You can take control again. Thanks, Booty Band Nation. Positive that you will get more sculpted, more toned, and you're gonna love those new healthy changes and our community and our coaches. From where you're at, no matter where you are, or how long you've been in the position. So just click the button below to book the call with our team.